I'm Umama. Hello, I'm Sufisha. Hi, I'm Amadou. The school library is the best place to find books, but it needs to be open under the supervisions of librarians. However, all the librarians may not be available all the time. Students' attitudes have also shifted. Their reading habits partly due to COVID-19 pandemic. Now, they prefer to read books on screen rather than physical books. Our group wants to design a robot prototype that can represent a human librarian. We present you a humanoid librarian. I'll be explaining the design process. Our group observed and interviewed some students on problems with reading in the school library. We identified two main problems. One, we do not have enough librarians during the whole school hour. Two, students are not motivated to read books. We came up with the idea of a humanoid librarian prototype. Next, we built the prototype. The robot prototype was built using recyclable materials. The robot has a cute face. There are wheels for movement. There are slots to put in a tablet and the books. There is a motor and it is battery operated. We created virtual avatars using Scratch by the MIT program. We programmed the robot using Raspberry Pi program. Finally, we tested the robot for interaction, movement, and dispensing of books. Do you want to see our humanoid robot? Here it goes! Supama is available 24-7, which means you don't have to wait for a librarian or a teacher to open the library for you. The virtual avatar will help to connect students and motivate students to read physical books. All in all, it can help improve access to the library and help improve students' interest in reading physical books. Now that you know the problems and how we plan to solve them, let me recap a few pointers. Sufama, a humanoid librarian, is an example of artificial intelligence meeting physical items. It will help students to read books and facilitate librarians. With further work, it will be helpful for school libraries everywhere. And the team is signing off. Who said super I love you?